Okay. I think I'm live. Anybody's on there, let me know. Give me a thumbs up or say something. Let me know if you're actually hearing this or not. Yeah. I mean, it shows that I'm live. So, hello, Aurelio. How are you? Um, I figure, you know, I'm pretty tired, but I figure we're going to just pull some, we're going to, we're going to pull a message. Um, for some reason, I don't know. There's a, there's a feeling of um, strong connection. So I don't know. Awesome, Marnie. I hope you are all well today. You know, um, I don't know. This, it's a feeling of, um, like there's, it could be twin flame or something, but it's, it's just like there's this connection and it's got something to do. I don't know. I don't know if that's what they're going to, what's going to come out or not, but I feel it. I can just feel it. It's like, it's very, um, strong and energetic. It's, so I don't know if any of you are feeling that or dealing with that or um, if you've been feeling it because it's it's very strong and it feels like that I don't know I don't know how to explain it it's so um, strong I know I am too we'll see it may not you know it may not come out in the cards but we will see um, let's see we've got a five I'll give it a few more minutes um, actually let's see Hmm. We can pull a few other cards until we get a few more people doing some moon cards. Oh, tonight is the full moon. So if you have anything you need to release, this is the Pisces full moon. This is going to be emotions. Um, release it. If you've got anything you need to release, release it. Let it go. I like to write it down personally. Go outside under the moon. I'll read it off and then I burn it and I let it return to the earth um, and release it. And then I like to come back in and I like to actually visualize seeing Archangel Michael cutting away what no longer serves me. Now that can be people, that can be relationships that did not serve your higher good. Um, it can even be behaviors or um, addictions, anything you know, that you need, you feel like you need to release about yourself. I know, yes, three nights, you know, three nights before, um, and then the night of, and then three, I did three more nights after that, actually. You don't have to write it down. Um, that's just for, for my, my person. Um, I feel like it's helped me writing it down and um, I like to just just write it down and acknowledge you know what I want to release and then I, I actually like to write down you know and acknowledge what I ask for so like if you're asking for a soulmate um, you know be sure you word that correctly <laughs> because as many of you know, soulmates just, they, they lessen us. They give us, I think it was, I think it was Aurelio that, that mentioned that, I think, last time, but a lot of lessons. Okay, we've got here, expect powerful change. See, now that's beautiful. That is beautiful. And then we got work through your fears. That's awesome. Look, prosperity lies ahead. Those are beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Those are good. And, you know, even if, if like, if you, if you are having trouble, even with, like, um, stability or, or something like that, I like to write that stuff down. And, um, Good exercises, good good things to do. Like um, you can even write like a story, you know, for yourself of what you want. You know, um, 
because I'm going to tell you, writing is powerful. And I can, I just feel it. I feel like it's very powerful. I really do. And look on the bottom. Confidence is your key to success. So that goes right along with those cards right there that we just pulled. That's, that's awesome. I think that is awesome. Truly. Um, I really, really do. I also feel like we've got, you know, it feels like we've got a lot of people that, that are healers and, and mystics and, um, you know, it's like they may, may be warrior. See, somebody may feel like they, it's like a battle. Okay. Yes. Okay. Um, someone's going through um, dark night of the, the soul it's very hard when but that's not a bad thing though going through that's not a bad thing because that that is release that is how to get through you know, what is that, that, I mean, I went through it. Oh my goodness. And some of these moons, full moons will do that to you. Some of them will do that to you. And, um, but you know, that's, that's releasing and, and it's awesome. I mean, you need to, sometimes you have to feel that pain in order to get through it and in order to um, release it, be able to go forward, be able to, move away from that past or whatever has been holding you back. I mean, that's honestly, that's the way I feel about it. I know. Um, I can't remember exactly which moon it was. I want to say it was the Capricorn moon, but I don't, I'm not sure if it was, it was one of the earlier moons. Um, and it was actually last year. Oh my Lord, I went through the dark, you know, the dark uh, night of the soul. I mean, it was, it was terrible. It was really uh, crying, upset, um, everything, just everything, you know, comes, comes out. It's like, I couldn't even go out under the moon. That's, you know, because all I wanted to do was, it was like, cry and think about everything. And, um, Actually, that helped me more than I ever knew. And sometimes we have to go through that. And these full moons can do that. They can bring it out. But, you know, sometimes you got to deal with it in order to um, be able to move away from it, I feel like. Yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, that's like me. I've got things that I've got to write down and release, you know. Just like everyone else. Um, we're going to take some angel cards here. And, and I don't mean the romance angels. I'm going to save those for the reading. I'm just trying to let people get built up. And hello, everyone. Maybe struggling in areas, you know, with moving forward or um, on your soul path. Or if you're, if you're on the, the twin flame journey, you know, um, there was a... a there was a time that I, I, I doubted, I didn't know if it was real, you know, and I have come to feel more like it is real. Uh, the twin flame, I truly have. I believe that that is real. I really do. Yeah. And, and, you know, Sandra, if, if you are an empath, they're drawn to empaths. And that's, you know, that's not a good thing. Yeah. I know, Rodrigo, that that was me. It's like you would have those, I would have those moments of all the pieces and crying. And then those moments of how could you, you know, it was just like anger of how could, you know, this happen? How could they do that to me? And um, 
but it really helped me to get that out. It really did more than I can. It, it, it's a lot. Uh, the moon can really bring a lot to the surface. And that's the truth. Well, I mean, it really makes you look at things. And that's just my opinion. But I, I'm telling you from my own what I've went through. And I've, yeah, this has been a journey for me. It really, a type of angel card. And they've already thrown one out. Ah, okay, I'm going to check these because they're popping out. Okay, and okay, this is um, this is actually the this is not the angel. Well, it is kind of, but it's the uh, crystals. And what it is is different people need different ones. But um, what I, what I want you to do is I will wheel these cards these to you if you don't have them. You know, uh, just feel like they're with you. And if it, honestly, to be honest with you, I would feel like. It's not all hurt, you know what I mean? So, let's see. My connection's going out. Yeah. Hopefully it doesn't go out. Okay, we've got Aqua Aura. Healthy communication in relationships. Heart-to-heart -heart discussions. And clear, assertive communication. Help you understand and be understand it. Underst understood. So there it is. Believe it's with you and it will be. And that can help you to go through that, you know, as far as communication, be able to communicate better. Okay. Kaya night. Make time for self care. Taking care of yourself is essential right now. And that's even for me, you know, I'm having to learn that. That's like today, um, I got home earlier and I just couldn't hold my eyes open I was actually trying to uh, do uh, videos you know and edit them and I was just sitting there my eyes against you I ended up having to lay down and take a nap and I normally don't do that but that's Kaya night believe it's with you and that can help you okay and then we have Sugalat and I like this on your divine power you know you've got it within you, own it. Know that you, what you're doing and that you can't help other people. You can help yourself. Um, yeah. It says, replace codependent people pleasing and, with assertiveness and empowerment. That's beautiful. That is, I love that one. Ruby, bless your heart. Reach out for emotional and spiritual, and it, we help one another. Um, you all help me, and it, it's just a peace. That's a beautiful card. Okay, then we have. Um, Oh my goodness, a, a, affiliate, affiliate, I think that's how I say it. I probably butchered it, but increased support, your positive focus and willingness to receive have opened the doorway to an abundance of help and opportunities. See, that's awesome. That's awesome. You know, we should all be owning these cards. We should be... Um, Feel it. Just feel it. Feel it with you and it will be with you. Amber. Oh my goodness. I love Amber. I've got some here somewhere. I'm not sure. It's here somewhere. Um, but yeah, it says give it to God. Like my little box down there. Give it to God. Um, you know, if, if, if you're worrying about, if I get to, I catch myself worrying about something. Um, I'll write it on a piece of paper and give it to God. I put it in that little box. Take a deep breath and on the exhale, release. 
this situation to God for healing and answers. So breathe it in and let it go. Give it to God. Give it to the angels. Um, yeah. Rose quartz, beautiful. You know, love. Um, rose quartz is just, you know, right here. That's love. That's, that's, oh, I just, you could feel the love just holding a rose quartz. I can just, I tell you, I love it. But uh, it says love life. New or renewed romantic love is here for you. Oh, my goodness. See there? Romantic love. See, now that's beautiful. What should I want on that one? <laughs> yeah. Okay. And here we go. We got beautiful opal. Let yourself sparkle and shine. Shine your light. Hello. And you are guided to be bold and show your bigger than life side to the world. So that's what we should all do and help one another, you know. And, and I mean, that could be just anything like anywhere. That's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Tiger's eye. Oh, I love that. Self-confidence through God confidence. Believe in yourself by believing in God working through you. See, that's awesome. Let spirit work through you. It's beautiful. Moldavites. Oh my goodness, I love Moldavites. That's what my necklace is too that I have. Um can't remember who got me that i love it unconventional let's see unconventionality that's what it says your unique many of us are very different that's beautiful those are beautiful and i feel like they for a lot of us um Okay, I think we're gonna we're gonna go on with the reading. We may do some more angel cards though, if y'all want to, because I mean honestly, I think they they throw out all these right here because I've got you know I've got several people watching. We've got like eleven, so I feel like that different people need different cards. But shucks, I mean, I just yeah, I I take it all in. Okay, we're gonna see what we get because we may get. I, I don't know. There was just a strong feeling that is it buffering? Oh my goodness. Yes, thank you, Tina, for mentioning that. Yes, please give the likes and um, anything to help help the channel to grow. And and get that gets more people, you know, get more people because there's so many people that um, honestly that this, you know, can help. I mean, seriously, and um, that's that's the whole thing about this is, you know, we I know for myself being different, it was lonely, but see, it's like now I have so many people, it it's just I love it, yeah, it's you know, it's you, be yourself, yeah, yes, okay, let's see what we get. We're just going to see. We are going to see. Okay. A special message. Pentacles. There's a connection. Okay, left out. There's a connection there. Very strong. We're very strong. Very. Okay. Queen of Pentacles. This is. This is the. being left behind took something from this person someone took something and um it's gonna be different for different people but i feel like for many um i'm gonna be honest i feel like it's this is this is that connection i was telling you about 
this is a, oh, it feels like a twin flame thing. Okay, for those of you that know who this person is, they've been watching. Or you've been watching now. Um, now, this is wanting to come back together. This is, um, someone wants to, but, you know, with twins, that's, yeah. Um, tell us more. Deeper. Deeper, please. Yeah, done the work. Okay, yes. You know, upright, that's about doing the inside work. That's about resting. That's about, uh, oh, my goodness, looking, thinking. Um, really, you know, you can, it can be diving deep. It can, So they're thinking. They haven't done what they needed to do to work towards, it feels like, a, it's about uh, the way I understand it. You know that union; those two mirror mirror in each other. Um, there's something someone's not; they're not; they're not doing it, and they need to be doing it. They need to be putting in the work. There's something they're not doing. Um, oh my goodness! What? What more? It's like they're they're at crossroads. See, see, they're at a crossroads. About relationship, about this. Okay, some of these, you, okay, some of you, you don't know this person. <laughs> oh, my goodness. This is like, um, this is, look, this is deep. This is, um, oh, my goodness. This is soul, soul to soul. It's like soul to soul. soul. That's what I'm getting. It's like they're drawn. They're drawn to each other. But it's, it, you see the moon over top of the head and then the eyes are cut. It's like they're, they're kind of stuck. They, they, they haven't, something they needed to do within themselves they've not done. Oh my goodness. Okay, yes, for some of you, now, this is just for some of you. See, now, you're going to have to decipher where you belong in this because they're giving me different things for different people, and I can't help it. Okay, for someone, this is twin flame, definitely. I'll try to get it for you to see. There was third party. And um, you may not even note it, but there was third party with a twin flame. That's what I'm feeling. This is strong. Uh, it could be a soulmate, but I'm feeling like this is very strong. This is so strong. Um, okay. It's like uh, for someone that this was someone from the past and they put you in a third party. Something, it's like they're not, they're not working on that relationship anymore. It's like they're confused about the relationship that they were in. It's it's like something's ending. So someone may be ending a relationship where they had put someone in a third party and that person didn't even know it. Oh my goodness. See, we got lovers. This is this is uh, strong. Oh yeah, there you go. Right there. Okay, yes. Oh yes. Okay. <laughs> Someone put someone in a third party. They, they, there was something toxic. Okay, and then someone's dealing with a Capricorn. Oh, my goodness. Okay, someone could be a Capricorn. This is about having strength. Uh, it is. You see that golden? That's strength. That's, uh, you know, it's finding peace having the strength to find peace after a lot of pain. This is pain. This is breaking my heart. Oh my goodness. Someone's, this is pain. But it's, it is growth. But it's like, 
that's taken so long to just grow that little amount. Someone, someone has really been hurt. And it's sad. That's sad. Can we know more? May we know more? Spirit, may we know more? Okay. More, please. More, please. More, please. Not absorbed. You see, that is okay. That's trying to open that door. That's trying to come in. That's trying to, um, it's like someone was, oh my goodness. Okay. Yes. Someone was trying to, they were trying to reach someone when they, there was, it wasn't reachable because it wasn't meant at that time. There was too much negativity involved and, it's like this person, whomever this is that's got this strength. It's like they've stopped trying to open that door because they, they've realized now is not the time. It's not right. The timing is not right. The timing is not right. You know, this is being guided, being being guided through sleep, through dreams, through, you know, and I also I feel like someone's being haunted, basically. Um, this feels like their own mind. Yes. Someone is letting their mind haunt them. See, that's nine of cups. That, that is wish, but I want you to look at this. I want you to look at this card. This is like someone getting everything that they want. You see there? And someone waiting on someone. This is not normal. And, um, it's like someone was, someone was trying too hard. Someone was putting in too much. And it's like they just can't, you can't keep going. You can't keep doing that. I mean, that's what I'm getting on that. And it's strong. It's very. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Yes. See, there's the seven of cups again. But this time, instead of it being in dream and haunted form, you know, and what I mean by haunted is sometimes, you know, if you're dealing with a twin flame or if you're dealing with a very strong connection, they can just haunt your mind. Just, I mean, seriously, you know, they can just enter your mind in just a blink and, and you can hear a song and, it can torment you. And if you look here again, asleep. Okay, someone, um, someone doesn't look at options. They don't. There's confusion. Uh, wait a minute. Someone, okay, someone is confused. Someone thinks that they have, oh my goodness. Someone thinks that someone that they have had was their twin and it's not. They're not. They're not. The twin is on the path. Okay, someone is not paying attention. They're not paying attention to their dreams. They're not paying attention to... It, it's dealing with a strong connection. They dealt with someone that was a very strong connection. They could have even been married to them. But that's not, the, that's not the twin. That's not the one. 
that they're meant to be with. Oh my goodness. This is very strong. This is very. Yeah. Okay, I don't I don't know who this is for, but um this feels like it's for more it's for different people because I mean you're gonna take bits and pieces. It's it's all over the place. It's for different different people, but someone out there they thought they had the one and it's got to do with this it's got to do with the devil card and it's got to do with this card. It's it's like they thought someone was the one, but that one, and they have stopped. It's like they're not seeing anything else because it's like they're stuck. They, they got themselves in that mindset. That was the one that was, and, and they're not seeing. Yes, faith. Exactly. I agree totally with you. And, you know, I've had people tell me, how do you have faith? I had, yeah, I had that happen. Um, I just do. I feel it. I believe it. But, yeah. How can you, you know, how can you not have faith? And... We're going, to, we're going to pull some more because I feel like there's another reading. It feels like there's another reading. Um, that right there was for me. And that's that was strong. That was very strong. And it was very sad. Very. When I got to the end there and it, it, it just. Someone got their. They got their heart basically just felt like it was ripped out and. Which I can't, you know, I've been hurt like that. And I know you probably all have too. Um, okay. Okay, we're going to see. I'm trying to... Um, Huh. See, I'm, I'm not, I don't know all of that, Sandra, honestly. Okay, I'm, I'm trying to, trying to think of a question to actually, you know, I mean, Ah, yeah. Uh, yeah, you're right, Rodrigo. But you know, when I feel myself get weak, and I have done it. Believe me, I have. You know, especially whenever you 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 feel like well, and then all of a sudden, you know, that bubble gets burst. Um. But the thing I have to look at is, you know, I can sit here and I can be not have faith. But if I do that, I'm just going to be miserable and I'm not going to, I mean, I'm not, I'm not bringing it in, I'm not even, you know, trying. And I can't do that. I have to, um, you know. I know, Tina. Yeah, I get him too in a way. I do too. That's what I'm saying. It's, and, you know, I can sit here, but I, I, I try to keep my mind away from that, thinking like you're talking about the divine timing. Um, very hard, though. 
very hard. I mean, oh my goodness, that's like my son. He told me he said, um, "Mom, do you know they have a boyfriend pillow?" And I'm like, "What? <laughs> it's a pillow that that you can actually lay on that's got an arm that'll lay around you." And he said, "Mom, I can get you one." I said, "I don't want one of them." <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, it is hard. I, I don't I don't do I haven't been drawn to do personal readings online. Now, I, I have picked up on people, uh, well, uh, several times, but. I mean, well, I do pick up on people, but I mean, I've done some, I have done some readings face to face. Um, yeah. But as far as online, I have not felt, and I haven't, you know, done anywhere I felt like I was, you know, supposed to charge or anything. I haven't done that. Oh, I love that, Rodrigo. I love that. Trusting. I love that. That's beautiful. Oh, that's fine, Aurelia. Okay. Let's see. They bent the temperance card. Look. I'm on to that path. Um, I feel like this is kind of like what we're talking about right now. You know, that faith and uh, that trust, Rodrigo. Like you said, I love that. Um, in that new beginning or in that new person or in that thing that we're trying to manifest and bring in. You know, I feel like it's all about Honestly, what they're showing is, well, you know, temperance, that can be about balance, but I'm drawn to the faith. I am. And the, the greenery, which is growth. That's interesting. It feels like that goes along with what we were talking about, faith and and trust, I love that, trust. Hmm. They wanted that card to come out. Oh, that was the uh, Knight of Cups. Oh, my goodness. Okay, see? <sighs> it's like on ourself. And, and finding our own happiness with ourselves that's when you know and doing that work we manifest what we want people do they, they really do they, they do manifest what they want you know and um, faith and trust I won't I won't I'm not going to give up on it um, yeah. Because I know what I want. I know what I want. If I if I give up on it, then I'm just giving in to, um, you know, feeling bad or, or being out of worry and all that. I'm not doing that. See? Expecting ships to come in. Yeah, that, that's it right there. Two of Pentacles. Okay. What I'm drawn to in this card right here is how you see all the storms. This is storms. But do you see how she's keeping this going? And you see the electricity 
into the infinity. That, that to me is about faith and trust. And even, even through the storms, no matter how hard it is, you know, oh my goodness. That's what I'm feeling with that. I'm going to take one of these. Though. If they'll give it to us, we'll, we'll see. They may not. May we have one? Okay, if anyone's dealing with, um, if anyone's got some out, someone out there that they want to, like, you're being told to flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. If someone has got that energy flowing that you like, flirt with them. Put it out there, if you, you know. How are they going to know if, you know, there's another one. Oh, my goodness. Where is it at? Oh, spirit, please. May I have it? May I have the other card right there? It is. Oh, there's two. Ah, and you ain't going to believe the one. Okay. Well, you're probably seeing it right now. Healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So somebody may have may have issues. You know, there's daddy issues. There's even mama issues. You know, things that may need to be healed things that may need to be forgiven and then you got calling in your soulmate your prayers affirmations and visualizations help bring it together and you know I, I know doing the affirmations and everything and, and it can be like when you know but yeah you just have to keep the faith and not giving up on what you want. That's right. I need to figure out how to do a moderator. I don't have a clue how to even do that. I need to figure that out, though. See, that Tina, that's something that card right there would be for. Exactly. Yeah. Um, let's see. Let's see if we can get some guidance from these angel cards. Let's see if there's something. Some form of guidance maybe to help. figure out where my other cards is at. Okay. Yeah. May we have the one or two. Please, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. There's the two. Okay. They give us the two. Awesome. We got Rosetta. You have a gift for working with young people. So somebody may have a gift for working with young people. They may not even know it. And your divine purpose involves helping, teaching, or parenting children. Beautiful. Let's say... Exactly, Rodrigo, exactly. See, that's what we was talking about earlier, you know, and yeah, we got Bethany. When you take excellent care of yourself, everybody benefits. Give yourself a relaxing treat today, such as a massage, sea salt bath, or pedicure. It's beautiful. Dang, I need to do all that, man. <laughs> That's beautiful. Okay. Let's see what these have to say. There it was. That's it. Oh, my goodness. You don't believe it. We got new beginning. 
That's beautiful. Look. New beginning. A new beginning. You're at the beginning of a wonderful journey. There's no need to have any fear. Thank you so much, Marnie. Thank you. As guardian angels walk beside you every step of the way, you have unique gifts to offer the world. If you will just free yourself from that which holds you back. See, that's what we got to do is free ourselves from anything that's holding us back. New opportunities will present themselves if you truly believe. That's absolutely beautiful. And you see that angel there? I'm telling you. Yeah, I'm going to write down everything that I need to, and I'm going to take it out, and I'm going to burn it. But I'm also going to visualize Archangel Michael. Um, yeah. <laughs> cutting it because I feel like I tell you that has helped me so much of cutting ties out that I needed to just you know seriously um work your light this is going to be I feel like going to be more for the ones that are I mean you know there's so many people that have abilities to help other people and it's it's just amazing whether, I mean, even just like going somewhere out in public and um, there's little things that can just make someone's day and just, it's beautiful. If it ain't nothing but opening a door for someone or something like that to just make someone's day so beautiful. They done throwed it out. Oh my goodness. What? We got Warrior Woman. Have you answered your deepest calling? So that's, you know, where we may need to meditate on that and ask our higher self, you know, is there more? Is there more that we need to be doing? I, I feel like there's one more. Okay. Please have the other card. The one, the one. Spirit. Yeah, please have the one, the one card. Thank you. Well, we got two. Okay, you're already doing it. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is something. Listen, have you answered your deepest calling? You're already doing it. Stop overthinking. Keep facing your true north. This is beautiful. Deep replenishment. Retreat, rest, see hell. See, that's what we all need to do is rest. And that, that's like me today. I took that nap. At first, I'm like, no, I need to do these. I need to get these um, videos, you know, put together so I can get them up. But I'm like, you know. I think I need a nap. But those are beautiful. Those are absolutely beautiful. Um, hmm. We're going to take one of these too. We're just going to take some cart because I feel like we need them. Honestly. It just feels like it, it's a benefit. Yeah. Okay. May we please have the card. May we please. Oh, there it went. Hope. <laughs> oh my goodness, look, look. Okay. Hope. Love and acceptance. Love is yours. Recognize your divine worth. Choosing, choose loving thoughts. That's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, let's see. Where are we at? I think I want to take one of these. Yeah. They're beautiful. Okay. Oh, they throwed that one all the way over there. I'm going to have to get it. Okay. 
Okay, now look at these and, and, and really look at them and see what they mean to you. See what they make you feel like. You know, I'm going to tell you, though, um, we got shape, we got clouds, shape-shifting, and we got waterfall effortless. Now, I want you to look. You know, clouds, they tend to just form different. They, 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 they can conform to this shape. They can, you know, and it's kind of like going every which way or or making a shape and, and you see what I'm saying is and then effortlessly look at the waterfall it just flows it doesn't it's, it's just going and I feel like that I feel like a lot of this is about um honestly flowing going with the flow um being that cloud just letting you know well I can kind of like um there was a point in my life where things had got to where I was having a very hard time honestly dealing with stuff. And I woke up one day and I felt honestly like a duck. You know, if a duck gets in the water, what does the water do? The water runs off the duck. I felt like everything that was hurting me, that was really bothering me at that point in my life, it stopped. It was almost like I was a duck. It just stopped. And I started to just, you know, I flowed. I flowed and I got through, I got through it. I got through it all. That's beautiful. I think that is absolutely gorgeous. Let's see. These. May we have the card, please? May we? May we have the card spirit, please. I know there's one. Uh, maybe two. May I have the card? No, I don't want to choose. Oh, there it is. There they go. They give us more. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay, we got several here, but there's a reason. We got sage. Be devoted and, and committed. So, you know, whatever it is that you need to, to be devoted on, whether that's your life path, um, that purpose, whether that is um, has to do with change or healing or helping others or stability, just where it is, you're being told to be devoted and committed. And then we got stargazer. Set your sights higher. So, you know, for some, you know, if this has got to do with um, stability or something, you know, maybe um, you're being told, like, say, if you're trying to find a job or something, you may need to set your sights higher. And, and even for those that are trying to help other people, uh, you may need to do more. There may be more that you can do. Like if you are, um, well, a lot of people read Tara. If you are a reader, maybe you are a healer as well. And um, yeah, it just, it's a feeling that there's more. There's so much more to so many and they don't know. Moon, take a note of intuitive messages. I love that. I do. You know, and that's just like the um, the synchronicity numbers. You know, I've got to where um, many times whenever I see them, you know, I've looked up so many of them. I've seen them so many times. But I feel like there's more to it. It's not just about the meaning. There's something that I'm going to get from it. So I've got to where now um, I can feel, you know, I feel, do I need to look up that meaning or do I need to just accept that number? And that's, yeah, if that makes sense. Okay. Then we got arrow. Surround yourself with protective energy. So I know I've told about putting a bubble around yourself. Now, you can use herbs and such. And thank you so much, Tina. Thank you. I truly appreciate that. Um, but you can also, you know, 
envision within you. And I mean, you don't even, you don't even have to do your, just yourself. Um, I have found that you can do your home. You can do your family. Um, you just simply need to breathe and calm yourself. I like to say a little prayer of protection upon me. And uh, I see whiteness upon me. And then I try to go within a little bit. Just just not completely. Not as if I was in a full meditation. But just enough to where I can feel it. And then I like to envision a bubble. A bubble around me. And I, I will put my home inside that bubble. I will put my family members, friends, people who mean something to me. You know, um, even uh, animals, your animals, your fur babies. And envision that, you know, that bubble is filled with, just feel it, love, happiness, positivity. And I like to envision that someone comes to that bubble and they're, they're rubbing it. They're trying to see through because... There's so much love within the bubble, it's hard for them to see through it. And then they try to knock on it, but they can't get in. And just, um, that gives me peace. That that brings a lot of peace. And, you know, as well as, um, a lot of people feel like that people will put something against them. I've had, I don't know how many people tell me that someone's put a hex on them and stuff like that. Um, you know, one thing is mirrors, envisioning mirrors around you, shining outward, you know, and um, if anything is put against you that's bad, you know, it's just like that bubble, that's protection, and that will bounce back, because you, you're protecting yourself, you're doing this, you know, um, spiritually, and that, that's what I believe. That's, yeah. Thank you, Rodrigo. You get some rest. Thank you so much for being here. I thank all of you. I thank you all for coming. I mean, it's, it's awesome. I love this. But that That is how I have found, you know, and I'll forget and not protect myself and I'll go in somewhere and it, you know, actually start draining me to the point where uh, my kids can, my little girl can see it on me. And she's like, mom, you didn't protect yourself, you know? And uh, yeah, she'll be right. But that, oh man, these cards, they have really, you know, showed us a lot. But we also had the shaman. Trust your higher forces. Yep. So, I mean, that's awesome. That's awesome. I love it. Yes, Marnie. Okay. Um, I know y'all have seen me wear. I have necklaces that I wear a lot. One is a quartz crystal that I found myself. You can put intentions upon those um, just by simply believing and feeling and will it to be there, to be within, like this crystal here. You know, if, if I wanted to put a t an intention on this crystal, uh, first I like to cleanse them. And, you know, these moons is good for charging um, cleansing them, you know, you can bury them, you can put them in the dirt, you want to remember where you put them, um, sage, um, even over a candle, but then, you know, I like to just hold, hold the crystal, and I like to breathe, I like to feel that breath, you know, coming in and going out, feel any negativity or tension leave your body and I like to feel like I'm protected I like to know that that I'm protected in a white light and then I like to just whatever I'm wanting to to in, 
put the intention for, uh, whether that be, you know, like the one crystal I have, Archangel Michael, protection, protection. And, um, you know, ask Archangel Michael to put protection within a stone. And uh, he will do it. I mean, there's so much. You can take a quartz, quartz crystal, clear quartz, and you can basically put the intention for it to be a different stone if you don't have a, a certain stone. Yeah, the obsidian. Um, I'm pretty sure that's the way. Yes, yes. Um, took me a minute, but yeah, I mean, there's so much that we can do to try to help ourselves. At a crossroads that was in our cards, um, I'm pretty sure. You know, many times, you know, I would ask, and um, in meditation, or you can get signs, you can get synchronicity, but you can also get feeling that can help you to um, be able to move through when you're in them crossroads where you feel like your eyes are covered and you feel like you don't know which way to go, you don't know what to do. And, um, you know, you can ask for feeling to help point you in that direction of what you need to go, which way you need to go uh, and what you need to do. And I mean, that's one, I feel like that's an awesome way of doing Um. I think we're going to take we're going to take one of these. I feel like we need an affirmation card. I really do. Okay, we need to. We got success. Look at there. Okay. Repeat after me. Okay, ready? I know that there is no greater goal than to love. I know that there is no greater goal than to love. I know that there is no greater goal than to love. And so it is. And then we got envy. Okay, repeat after me, please. I am the same as everybody, but with different challenges. I am the same as everybody, but with different challenges. I am the same as everybody, but with different challenges. And so it is. That is absolutely beautiful. That gave me chills. That's beautiful. Oh, I'm sorry, Jimmy. That's terrible. I was trying to think where my other cards is at, and I'm not sure where they're at. It's my big crystal cards. I love them. I used to use them a lot. Hmm. I think we're going to take one of these. Whoops. Not that one. Okay. Nope. These are beautiful cards. See? Okay. Ready? May we have the card, please. May we have the card, Spirit. May we have the one. Oh, my goodness. Hmm. It belongs. It's for someone. 
Okay. We got three. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Yawning. First, we got celebrate life. You know, and that takes me back to being grateful. Being grateful for, for life in general. And no matter what has happened or what has gone wrong or, you know, and I look at these wings right here, you know, that's like, um, that's like a butterfly, you know, emerging from a cocoon. It's just beautiful. And it, it makes me think of dragonflies too, as well, which I feel is that's spiritual around us. I love it when they get around me. You know, and then we've got strength in this card. We've got strength. We've got a wolf. We've, we've, we've got what looks like a cheetah here. But then we also have the hummingbird. You know, to me, that's graceful. That's flow. Um, yeah. And then we have the eagle. But we also have the frog. Huh, and I'm really drawn to the frog. You know, I love frogs. Frogs are, um, I just, I love the way that they just, they hop around, but they're very, they're in their own. If you, if you see one and it's just sitting there and, you know, I've watched them and they just sit right in front of you like they're they're in their own, you know, waiting for a fly to come by. OK, it says I celebrate every day by honoring and respecting all life on Mother Earth. So I, that's absolutely beautiful. I feel like that's beautiful. You know, that, to me, that's a loving life, and that's loving the life that, that, that Mother Earth, you know, spring, springs forward and brings forward and grows forward. Now we have balance. No, we have. I understand and embrace the opposing forces in life that bring about balance. That's beautiful. Then we have forest frolic maiden. Gorgeous. And it says, I acknowledge my inner child and open my heart to the joy she brings. Or he brings. That's absolutely gorgeous. That is. Absolutely love it. Okay. This card just fell off of this deck. And I'm feeling it. It's actually medicine mother. Honor your inner knowing. Well, I have truly enjoyed this. I'm going to, um, I've got to get some sleep though I'm wore out and um, get some rest I just keep yawning yes aqua power a lot of us Aquariuses not all of us but you probably got Aquarius in your birth chart yes I sure hope to I do I sure do me and, me and Teddy Bear will cuddle up and hopefully, I don't throw them across the room. I did last night. Yep, I slept with a teddy bear. I admit it. it was a pillow, but now the teddy bear is saying that works. You do that. 
that, Sandra. Yeah, do that. Um, you know, I've prayed, and I know that if that time if that time comes, I'll start doing it. It's just like about doing lives, you see. I didn't do lives for a long time, and I kept praying about it. And just all of us, you know, I was telling my son, I was like, you know, I feel like I'm going to start doing lives. And just one day, one day, you know, it just come. And I done it um, with him a couple of times uh, with using the phone. And then I finally figured out how to um, – do it more but you know I had to wait a little bit because I kind of felt a pullback and then all of a sudden it just hit me it just hit me it's time uh, so that may be the same with doing the um, you know actually offering readings personal readings because I have done readings for people but it's it's been here or it's been around me um, it's, it's not been through here through the web yeah so yeah pray about that um we should all pray for one another and and send love to each and every one of you and much love to you all and uh, thank you so much for joining me love y'all and good night sweet dreams